Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Heather P and I'm here just to start a vlog series with y'all. Are y'all ready? I don't even think y'all are ready because I'm literally not ready, but guess what? I'm ready. So this morning I got up, I got out the shower and I got a phone call, two emails, letting me know that I had been let go from my company. I was with my company for almost three years and I was laid off and it was due to COVID. Um, it is what it is. I have a lot of time to put back into my crafts, time to relax, time to spend with God, my family, my love, my boyfriend, and really just prioritize what I wanna do in life. Do I wanna go back into tech? Probably. <laughs> do I wanna go to marketing? Do I wanna do social media full time? Do I wanna sell digital products? Stay tuned. Um, but just, I have so many options. And so what I wanted to say is, I'm grateful for today. Um, and yeah, I wanted to bring you all on this journey with me. Welcome to day one of me being an employee. So the goal behind this series is actually to let y'all know what's going on every single day until I do get employed. That could be like get ready with me, makeup, videos, applying for jobs, interviews, how my products are coming along, if I do want to sell digital products, if I don't, whatever the case may be. I'm bringing y'all on this journey and what we're going to do is we're going to actually track how long it takes for me to get reemployed, the steps I took, what made a company better, how are the interviews, how is the money talking. All in all, like I said, I'm very thankful and glory to God for allowing me to have this moment where I can rest. It's so funny, Bishop talked about it being the year of rest and now I get to do it in the last couple of months. The other funny thing about it is too, I, I was going to create a, a, a something. I'm not gonna tell you what it is because I'm gonna keep that prep for now, but I'm creating something and God laid it on my heart last night. I was up till 3 a.m. drafting the outline and just making sure I knew what I was talking about and doing and in the morning, this morning, I got laid off. Funny thing is, is there was a huge connection between my job, my industry, and what I was doing. So I think God is really just <laughs> doing this on purpose. He has a funny way of showing himself mighty and sovereign. He has a funny way of showing you that he's always yet in control. But thanks be unto God, I believe in him to do exceedingly and abundantly above all I could ever think, dream, imagine. And with that, I just know bigger and better is coming my way. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get off of here. I found those dumplings that were viral on TikTok actually at my CVS and before that I went to two Kroger's and they were not anywhere to be found. So I'm gonna go in there, show you how those dumplings taste, maybe make a smoothie later on tonight, watch some videos and just relax. I didn't cry, I didn't cry. I didn't, I didn't share one tea, no, no. I didn't share no tears, no, no. <laughs> no tears y'all, but I still feel away. I still feel, it's like I feel relieved, but also too, nobody likes to get laid off. Nobody likes the process of being let go, um, especially when you put so much into something. But like I said, to God be the glory, he's given me the grace to rest in this, in this season and to rest in this new assignment, whatever it may be. And so, yeah, come on. So I'm here with Simone, bestie for the restie. She came and grabbed me. Had to. We were at dinner. To. Day one, unemployed. It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Ain't it crazy? No. Yes, but we're about to eat. We got some salads, some drinks, strawberry lemonade, and a coke. All right, it's a bread. So Amen. Amen. <laughs> What's up? Good morning and welcome to day two of me being unemployed. Yes, I'm still in the same shirt, but that's my business, okay? I'm about to go ahead and get ready to go and get coffee. So we're about to go meet up, chit chat, and then tonight I'm going to the blood prayer tour with my first lady and I need something for the Lord, so I'm gonna be there, all right? I hope you're there too. But yeah, come along on this journey. Talk to you soon. Uh, welcome morning with my mind. Yeah, all right, so I've just finished having a coffee. We went to Sweetwater's Coffee and Tea in Canton, Michigan, and it was delicious. If you haven't tried it, go and try their cream and caramel latte. It's delicious. Um, and also, we had their breakfast sandwiches, and they were bomb diggity. I had the sausage, egg, and cheese on a biscuit, and she had the croissant. So now I'm gonna go spend my money as an unemployed woman in America at Target. I saw on Instagram, um, one of my favorite makeup beauty girls um, makeup by Germany. She is my absolute favorite. She was using these um, drops on her face and she said it was like sunscreen but it still had enough pigmentation in it to kind of give some coverage. So they're called Indeed Laboratories Nano Bronze Bronzing Drops and so I'm going to see if I can go find them at Target. I'll talk to y'all really soon. Peace. 
you know what's so dumb? What's so dumb is that I can record myself while I'm driving because I have a tripod and it's sitting right there. I don't know why I look like I'm so close to the steering wheel. Like I'm five, nothing. I'm five two. So anyways, it is what it is. But sorry. I want to kind of talk to y'all about <laughs> me being laid off and just how that really affected me yesterday and that's why I feel like I'm gonna be okay regardless of the situation because God's got my back. I don't know how to feel. I sincerely don't know how to feel. And with that all being said, I feel like it's such a blessing and we have to believe and trust God's power and understand that everything that he does is going to happen and it happens for a reason. And every promise of our life, if he says it, it has to come to a, into pass. It has to come to pass. It has to go into fruition. So God told me that anything I see I can have. It's been prophesied to me for many years and I feel like it's the truth as it pertains to me. And God has yet to change his mind, but I think right now he's challenging my faith while building me. I want to document that I was working on that project, y'all, and I'm still going to continue that project. And what you'll see is I don't want to say the name of the project on here right now because truthfully I don't want people to bite. I want to just work on this and let God really download it to me what he will have me to do with this project and to the end results. But I do want to make note of what it is and whether I go into this next journey of my life or not, I'm still going to release it. And if it applies to me or not, I'm still going to release it because I'm doing it on faith and I'm doing it on credit that God will bless me in this season for what's to come. So I'm about to go live my best life. Um, and yeah, that's it. It's hot. All right, y'all, so I'm here at Target, about to go in here. Um, Tim just sent me $20, and that was very nice of him just to brighten up my day for some coffee. I already had my coffee, though, so what I'm gonna do is actually come in here, look for those makeup drops that I just talked about, talked to y'all about, and then if I have any left over, I'll get a refresher. So, come along for this journey. Right, peace. So I'm in Target right now, and so far, no good. I'm looking for the nano drops, but I'm not seeing it, and the Wi-Fi here also is very trash, so I'm trying to log onto the Wi-Fi. I hope I really find them. I don't know. I just feel like I never had the best of luck. Let me see. Indeed Laboratories. It looks like this. And they're also actually cheaper at Ulta, so... Hmm. Do I leave? Do I stay? Should I stay or should I go? Let's see. Let's see what I can find. Alright, y'all. So the gag is I went in there and they told me that I guess starting September 21st, they'll be getting Ulta products. So that's a tidbit for you. I bet you didn't know. So come to Target end of September and they'll have Ulta products within. I'm gonna keep going Ulta, amen, amen. But I got this water, y'all. Starbucks has the best water, always will, always has. It's like double, triple purified, it's amazing. Okay, so going back to Makeup by Germany, she was actually using the previous place bronze, and so I'm gonna give it a test. I've never seen these before, but I do have their palette right now. I actually, let me see, I have two of their palettes. I used this one right here, I use their blush, and then I also use their bronze palette. So I'm trying to really understand the difference between this one, maybe it's cream, not powder. Um, but the blush palettes are already really amazing as is. Let's see. So these say that they're bronze creams. So these are probably going to be really good to get you a nice glow. Um, unfortunately, I looked and they don't have those drops inside of store. You can only get them online. So. I was gonna kind of do that makeup look today, but I don't have what I need to do. I wanted to get the also, um, I think that's Dior though, and I'm in Ulta. But I wanted to get the liquid cheek. I'm gonna see if they have Rare Beauty in here or something else that I can use, but one second, let me see. Okay, so I just actually grabbed the caramel, and I'm gonna see what this one looks like. I just really feel like this is so nice. It's so creamy. Julia's Place does no wrong for me. Let's put it right here. This is giving me though, like, this one's giving me more my tone. Hmm. What's that? Okay, so the caramel and the cocoa are too dark. I really like the texture of this when it goes on, but I think this amber one is going to be the one that I actually go home with. So we're going to give this a test. Let's see. It's kind of really dark. So, 
Oh yeah, that's pretty. Hi, good, how are you? Super pretty. Okay, yep, so I think the amber is going to be a winner. And I can't wait to go home and try this on. They have some sales, so I'm gonna walk around and see who will tell me what those are and see if I can grab some. I only have $20 though, like I said. No, I have a little bit more, but I got $20. All right, so I'm here. I've kind of gone around and got a whole bunch of different things. They also are doing 21 days, 21 days sale. I don't know, something like that. Um, and so I got actually this right here, the Bad Girl, Bad Gal, <laughs> Bed by Benefit. I think I've tried it one time before and I loved it. So I'll get that. The Lancome that I reviewed, they have that on display there. And also to the Urban Decay that I reviewed is up at the front, the metallic palette. So all of those things are in store now. Make sure you go out and grab them. But yeah, I'm about to try this Tarte Man Eater. One of the consultants recommended it. I don't even know if this is my color, but we're just gonna get a feel for texture, how it goes on, how it turns out, all of that. Let's see. So this definitely is very, very pink. <laughs> but again, we're just gonna see what it looks like. And since I don't have makeup on right now, I'm gonna actually put it directly onto my cheeks. This is actually like really pretty. It's like that. It's very pink, very blushy, very rosy. Again, though, like I said, this would definitely be for a day where I'm just wearing very light concealer, mascara, a gloss, which is a day like today. So we'll see. Let me actually go ahead and try the Juvia's Place as well. This right here though is in the color Berry. So look what you see here. This is Berry by Benefit. I'm just playing Berry by Tarte. Okay, again, though, like she said, there were not many colors over there. It's like all the pink and rosy colors they ran through. But again, this is Lily Love in Juvia's Place. And we're just gonna see what it looks like just for good measure since we're in the store. Um, looks really silky. So I'll just cut it in. Y'all, can you see this? <laughs> Absolutely not. If anything, what I think I'll do is I do think I want to take this tart with me home. For my skin, this was too much. All you need is one dot of this, so literally, like, this probably could last forever. All right, so, okay, today is Dane. I love this for me. I went to the store and I was just in there and I had my camera and I'm just talking, talk, 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 talk. And just really enjoying my day. Like, I just was being intentional about enjoying my day. I didn't feel rushed. I was trying on all different types of products and I can't wait to get home. I have like an hour or so before I need to actually leave to head out to Toledo. But I was actually just talking to a lady and she's actually a consultant for a specific brand. And what I found out about that is she said they were currently hiring. And on top of that, um, she thought I would be perfect for the job. And so pretty much she gave me all these compliments. She said she liked my cheekbones, all of this stuff, how great I would be for this role. And so I'm gonna take her up on the offer. I, why not? Like I'm getting into my content. I'm like really excited to begin um, diving deeper into makeup. And so that's what I think I'll do. I think I will hit her up. Look at all these people coming off of work. All right, so I had to pull up to get some air in my tires. I came to Firestone because um, it was the closest place that I saw. After this, I'm going to grab some gas, get some snacks, and then be on my merrily way. Um, and yeah, I'll see y'all very soon. Okay, so I'm back at home and I'm actually about to try these steamed dumplings. So I'll let you know how they go. These have been a trend on TikTok and I actually found them at CVS for right now. I'm gonna eat these and then go get ready to go because I gotta go soon. 